guess this is the Minel Gamer. Um, some of you asked me to do a, a video of my setup in my streaming room and talk a little bit about what I've done with OBS and all that. So this is what I'm doing right now. So we're going to talk about OBS, what I use as an equipment for streaming, um, and my computer, my PC, my streaming PC. So this is where it all happened, like right behind me. And I'm sorry about the quality of this um, video. I'm just, I'm, I'm filming with my cell phone, guys. I don't have an HD camera. Come on, let you go. All right, let's go. So this is my bear. Maybe, maybe you cannot see him. It says welcome. So just open the door and go in. All right. So it's quite small. Hello, me again. It's quite small. It's like four meters by four meters, something like that. It's a small square. Shut up, kitty, I'm making a video here. And that's how it is. You know, it's my green screen that I have, you know, the, the duck, that little leg here, and the wall is behind me. Don't pay attention to the posters. And then, streaming setup. All right, quite simple. Turning around. All right. That's my two screens. That's my streaming PC. That's my cat. That's my streaming PC. That's the headset that I use. 7.1 sauce around system with a quite quite a good microphone for like 80 bucks. I, I don't regret it. That's the third screen that I use. All right. So I'll go over um, my PC spec. Really simple. 16 gigs of RAM, two SSDs of one of 120 gigabytes, the other one of 240 gigabytes, and a Seagate 7.2 Tor per minute, 7.2K Tor per minute, yeah, 7,200 Tor per minute, of two Terabytes and uh, tires stream for like what five hours? I woke up at six. I love you guys. Um, a processor of it's an i7 Intel, uh, 4770 K. K means you can't overclock it, but I don't because I don't have a liquid cooling system and it would be bad. Um, video card, I have two GTX 770 from NVIDIA, um, they're really good, but I'm not using my SLI when I stream because you need a little program called TIEX TORY, T-O-R-Y, uh, that allow you to rescale your resolution and your image and work with it, so when I stream with um, that program it used a lot, like about 30% of my CPU and sometimes depending on the games and the quality I'm looking for, uh, the CPU it's, it's, it's just topping the 100 and when that happens, bad, it's bad. You, you, when you stream you want 80% of your CPU usage and when you keep the other 20 for whatever whatever the fuck your computer is running in the background. Um, whatever may happen, you know, a lot of details, a lot of Bull crap happens, and you just you're glad that to have like that extra 20% of your CPU usage. Just do control alt delete, go to performance tab. We're gonna show, I'm gonna show everything to you guys in a moment. <clears throat> but before, you know what's around me? You know, you know what do I use? So as you guys can see, when I'm like that, and my camera actually, my webcam is right here. This is what you guys see without the chroma key of. Um, of OBS, you know, just a green screen, a regular green screen, and I put a pole on top of it, you know, with two things to hold it, two stands. Thank you very much, brain. And what's behind the webcam, you know, because there's fucking light around here, because the light in my room is behind the green screen. This is the light we're seeing right now. It's the light that I have. Well, actually, it came, I had a good deal on Amazon. For like 80 bucks, I got that green screen, 9 feet by 6 feet, if I remember well, and two light stands with some umbrellas, white umbrellas that come with it. It's fucking awesome. So I'm just turning around like this real fast and I'll show you. So that's one. This is the one that right now it's on my left, but usually it's on my right when I stream. 
Uh, what's fucking cool about the umbrella, it kind of removes uh, all the shading around me, so on the green screen we don't see a lot of shading, and that's fucking OP. And also, something I really love about these umbrellas is when I stream, you know, like, my screens are there, so I'm looking over there, you know, I, actually I'm looking over there, and I have that light bulb with all the umbrella, it's really bright in my eyes, and it's fucking killing me, and I have two of those, see, I have another one here. This one is a little bit less brighter, we used to smoke a lot in the room, so it got yellowish. Stop it, kitty, stop kicking me. So it got yellowish, but this one is white. The most important thing is, you know, the light balance, that's all. You just want on your green screens, turn again. To have like one color right here about, it's a little bit darker, and when I go right here, it's a little bit like whiter, but with OBS, you can actually fix it quite easily. and. What's cool about my webcam, which is a Logitech C920, if I remember well, uh, 1080p, but I put it in the 720p because why would I want Twitch? You know, I'm not partner, so everything is 720p. So why use more CPU and computer resources on something that is fucking useless? Useless, but it have the 1080p. 60 FPS, if I remember well, and I'm not sure, it might go higher than 60 FPS, but I'm not sure, you know, any more than 60 anyways. And with that, I can actually um, play with the color settings, you know, make my skin more beautiful, more colorful, more awesome. But enough of that. So that's what I use as materials for streaming. Green screen, two light stands with uh, the armor that comes with it, go on Amazon. You can, I bought the full kit, like I said, for $80 at the taxes, and it's like, what, a, it's $92 something, and I waited like two weeks for shipping. Totally worth it. I got it on special, though, because I think the regular price was 170 So yeah, I got quite lucky on that. So usually, you know, I can I can do this way better than crappy, crappy camera filming everything. And you know what? We're not gonna do it like that. I'm gonna record with my OBS and I'm gonna show you all my screens. What do they do? What they use for? And everything you see. Why do I need it? Etc. Etc. Moving on.